You're watching Suck Professor. Hello, everybody. It's me. My name is Hank, and I'm with... My name is... Ah, uh, James. Hey, James. Hey. Stupid Opinions. Welcome to the show. It's our one renewable resource. <laughs> we have an endless amount. So we're looking at Destiny concept art from Bungie from before the game or during the development of the game. Um, one of the things we want to highlight here, let's take a look at the first one, though, is, mm -hmm. is kind of thinking about how uh, so much of this did not end up in the game, mm -hmm. right? Right. But uh, to be fair, this one picture right here is probably the closest what to What are the we game. looking at? Who's this guy? This is a... Well, that seems to be a higher level wizard. Okay. The only problem is there's no wizards in the game that actually walk on the ground. They all kind of float around. Ah, I there's see. There's none that typically look like that. The long, they do have flowing robes, but yeah. not in that style. That looks like it'd be tough to walk on. No wonder that they would invented be, yeah. flo floating. Floating would solve the problem yeah. of tripping on your dress. So I'm wondering if that's like an early version of Omnigol, which is uh -huh. basically a wizard general. Okay. But the things around it are pretty spot on to the game. Those are thralls. These are thralls. And these yeah. are those little motherfuckers that just come charging at you. Yeah, yeah. the part of the hive army. I had so, a sex dream about a thrall. It was a really bad night. I had to go to the go to McDonald's and get cool off. Okay. All right, next one here. <laughs> so Ooh. this is clearly some guardians. Yes, looking down the distance, they're yes. probably looking for uh, McDonald's or something. Yeah, but the the one thing that <laughs> jumps out, the tiger. Yeah, what the heck is the tiger doing? That there? is a neat little fella, though. Yeah, it makes you think that the game has got pets in it, but yeah, you know. or yeah, I suppose pet would be. I was I was going to say partner. I yeah. like to think of my pets if I'm making them work. As mm -hmm. a partner, they don't call police dogs pets. They yeah. call them partners, and they give them cop burials, which is dumb because then you got to do one every fifteen years. Yeah. Um. All right. <laughs> Ship in the background. Interesting. I yeah. like it. I like yeah. the lion it, or it, the tiger. It, it looks pretty entire. I mean, doesn't represent at all what Destiny turned out to be. But yeah. you know, it's... but there's also not that much to work with. There's just some yeah. some adventurers with a pet. All right, lady. Sexy, okay. I mean, that, that not bad. Typically, that's the, looks like a female hunter or yeah. a titan, possibly. That could be the concept art for the stranger. She bought a shirt without a pocket, so she took some chalk and drew uh, one on. Yeah, smart. <laughs> I like it. Place to keep place place to draw another cell yeah. phone on top of it. Yes, yeah, so there's, there's there's nothing inherently wrong. <laughs> no, about that's that all right. One. This is near the beginning of this the game. one. We kind of talked about something similar to this earlier on. Yeah, in another video. Pretty close to what actually showed up in the, it's game. the opening scenario with all the rusted out yep, cars. The wall on Earth. Yeah. So like the light poles are still standing. Oh, that's some pretty yeah. good construction. These two guys are actually looks like there might be a third one right there. They're checking it out. They're having a nice time, wondering what's going on. What's behind this wall? Let's walk yeah. all the way down to the end. Oh, they can't. They can only go through the one door. Yeah, Peter it's Dink a fairly linear experience. Peter Dinklage wants yeah. to go. We're gonna keep moving. Okay, okay, a little bit of this one too. This is the, clearly the Fogoth battle. It's obviously the strike. we all know that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's going on here? Five guys. Uh, yeah, five guys in the finished game. It's really a strike one, for only three two. people. Okay. Oh, I see what you're saying. Well, that's that's a forgivable sin. Yeah, you know, I they think made it's okay. You want a couple yeah. more people to make it more interesting. Yeah. That's fine. By the way, I've bought chains at the hardware store. They get expensive. Yeah, it's funny okay. you mention that because in that one fight, if you fight him through the doorway and kill him, he disappears, and then you run into the room, and Peter Dinklage's voice pops up and goes, "Well, at least he's still chained up. But he's not there. <laughs> he's dead." Ha ha. <laughs> so you know that's a running gag there yeah this this uh, is interesting uh, is that a head yeah th that represents is... uh probably a cabal legionary on mars oh. and my favorite thing about those guys is uh -huh. that they're these big hulking brutes with uh -huh. these little heads but you shoot them in the head and it pops oh the head just explodes like yeah pretty like a, much a balloon and of water exactly yeah and it never gets old i love yeah, it yeah that doesn't get old i grew up shooting watermelons in the backyard nice it was not my watermelons it was mm -hmm. um they, they weren't even watermelons they were they were sparrows what well, they were sparrows okay. and they would explode when i shot them <laughs> all right uh this is pretty standard stuff though there's nothing too weird about this yeah, is cool i yeah, like it that I, looks uh, that again could be uh another concept art of the stranger mm -hmm. who's an exo hunter female yep. or it could just be an exo hunter female player character player you know? character Look at her. She didn't obviously. She was a little tired when she put on her shin guards yeah. in the morning. Okay, let's keep rolling. Now, now we're getting into like the yeah. big this vistas and conceptual. Yeah, and, and that's Jupiter, by the way. Nah, Can I, I point that out? That's the big red spot in Jupiter. Oh, yeah. uh, by the way, being a moon that close to Jupiter, your mm -hmm. fucking planet would be fucked up because the gravity is so powerful. Yeah. It screws with the planet and all that stuff. Now, Tidal uh, frictions. Yeah, we should mention in terms snow, of yeah. There's no snow in Destiny. There's None. no snow. None. Not even on the moon? It's cold there. Yeah, but no water. Oh, they must have had global warming. Yep. Yep. So right. this is did not You can. This looks like some happen. sort of cool structure below, and obviously towers that go up that are sort of either by design, but moon, winds, moon, moon swept, wind swept, snowy plains. Yeah. Hey, maybe it'll happen. Uh, 
What are they going to charge for? And Destiny for? Strikes Back when yeah. they go to Hoth. Maybe Destiny 2. Okay, here we are. Oh, speaking of Star Wars, here's uh, the Dagobah system is having yeah. a KKK rally. Yeah. So, like, <laughs> or, so like, or a Gandalf convention. Yeah, I mean, no one's ever been intimidated by men in white robes and hoods in the woods. Yeah. You know. Eerie men, eerie tall skinny men in white robes and hoods in the woods standing next to... Uh, uh, tree pop, branches. Tree, old creepy tree branches. Yeah. This actually looks cool. Is there any environment like this in Destiny The closest all? thing you're going to get to that is a very tiny, minuscule section of Sparrow Run... Way okay. in on Venus, but uh, not really. No, th- this yes. looks way cooler than. This looks really cool. I wish I could go there. I bet Kate Blanchett's there, the, the elf woman. Yeah, and, that's uh, even the right name. And I think Inya's in the tree singing. Yeah, for and, the acoustics. Uh, and Inya's up there in a tree singing like a squirrel about dead dogs. Yep. All right, here we go. This is another one. This is like a petrified forest area, yeah. which not in the game in any remote sense. not even close not looks even cool close. it does are those look cool. mushrooms or like buildings it's hard to tell I, I, that looks like a giant tree trunk uh-huh. with uh just desiccated and broken apart and yeah all messed up yeah where are the trunks that fell off there should be like big long flat logs if the tree trunks are all busted up maybe uh, it was mine ma- for yeah i was about to say maybe like you yeah. know you know who knows what can happen over so many so many years that's yeah. one thing i'm sad i'm alive now i won't be alive in the future makes me really sad look at all these birds yeah. that's cool <laughs> yeah <laughs> are there and, birds in destiny uh yeah you can't oh. even, you can't even shoot them out of the sky though. look at these weird birds they look like metal things yeah i mean and this, this one is awesome it is awesome and yeah. it creates an impression that the world has massive scale that you can explore that you can get up far away and then yeah. walk in close to things Nothing like that exists in Destiny. Nothing at all. Absolutely nothing. Okay. <laughs> Everything is pretty... Is it linear, would you say? I yeah, mean, you absolutely ch- linear. Yeah, I mean, well, the, the levels are, but you can yeah. choose where to go, I guess. Well, yes and no, because they reuse the same areas over and over. So let's say, for example, there's this one hive fortress, and you're on a particular mission. So when you go into that fortress, the, mis- the door in the fortress that leads to that mission is open. Okay. But if you do a different mission and you go to that fortress, that door doesn't open, but the door for the other mission opens. Oh. So you're restricted on where you can go. So it's open, but it's not open. Ugh. That's like being that's like a Twilight Zone episode where you pick a door and you yeah, open your own. that it, doesn't make any sense. All right, moving along. This actually, for some reason, this makes me think of Minecraft. <laughs> yeah. Well, this it's makes just, me think of it looks like, like you'd be sneaking up and on someone's yeah, really cool exactly. wooden wood like, hidden in the woods fortress yeah i see this and i think okay you're outside of the tower you're in a section of a city that's no longer being protected by the traveler the fallen have infiltrated it the people who live here now are huddled and hiding inside their houses they can't go out in the street it's not safe they're real touchy they don't like outsiders you're stealthing through trying to find them to save them or get information or doing something like that nothing remotely like you don't get to do any story you don't go into any cities like that you don't see any non-guardian characters or npcs outside of the tower yeah completely it's such a shame like that they could do so like there's the because the action is so fun yeah it would be it would it would make the action more meaningful and like like those things harmonize together story exactly. and action harmonize if they're both working together and, and how do you nail one so perfectly and yeah. yet fail the other one so horribly yeah i know i have a game where i do i chop trees down the whole time i love mm-hmm. it i chop trees down for hours and hours and hours mm-hmm. me and an entire fire team of 1200 men we chop down a tree, falls over. That's all it does. We don't have a story. Mm. We're not, we don't have a wife. Or, we don't have a pregnant wife who lives off bark in, in big grubs. <laughs> all right. I don't know why I said that. I, I make bad choices sometimes. Uh. I'm sorry. Speaking of choices, this is awesome. This looks like a... like. <laughs> this makes me... Th- this has a, a Japanese feel to me for yeah. some reason. And Almost if- like a snowy, first of all, which yeah. we don't get. Uh, these are mechs, obviously, crawling around, walking around in a big, thick... No, I wouldn't say densely populated, but you know, a, a tight cityscape, mm-hmm. urban area looks like buildings might be a lot of places to explore. Nothing like this, right? If you I were mean, to show me that picture and give me ten guesses as to what its concept art for, I wouldn't even come close to saying Destiny. Oh no way! It doesn't look a th- nothing about that yeah. says Destiny. But it looks. I would want to know more about the world this picture. Yeah, I from. mean, I would guess maybe a Metal Gear Solid game, yeah. maybe a Final Fantasy game. Um, yeah, a RoboCop game possibly because <laughs> sure, you know like that. maybe uh, like but, a Half Life. This yeah, looks like exactly. A Half Life, like with you know aliens yeah. taking over. But there or... are no giant mechs like yeah. that. There are no bustling cities. There are no Destiny does not. Yeah. And the frustrating thing is that when you're in the tower in Destiny, 
you look out in the, the vista around you, and there's these big cities just like this all around you. Right. You can't go there, though. Yeah. I mean, yes, there are, yeah, that's, you're right. Yeah, mm-hmm. the whole thing is, uh, it's, and it's gorgeous looking, and you, yeah. it makes you want to go there. But it's a it's, painted backdrop, really. It's a skybox. It's, yeah. You know, it's, it's not... A diorama. Yeah. It's, <laughs> I don't even it's know if that's right. depressing. Have you ever you, had you a person know? step on your foot? It yes. hurts. I bet when a mech lands one of these big feet on your foot, Man, ooh, it's off to the doctor right there, huh? <laughs> All right, more super busy. Like this yeah. almost looks like a like a bazaar. Yeah, like, like a, a like living a organic world. Yeah. Which no, there'd be trade booths. There'd be come up to vendors and they'd say weird, creepy shit like, "My meat has been the best meat in four hundred years." Okay, yeah. next one. <laughs> This looks now, like Tower. Okay, yeah, this one actually has some sort of resemblance mm-hmm. to the Tower in the game, yeah. although it's much more wide open areas. That statue's not in it. I'm giving him you a know? lightsaber be- penis. The- it's a light penis with blue. <laughs> <laughs> that means he's one of the good ones. Also not in the game. <laughs> There's no lightsaber penis? No, sadly. That's Tube saber. Maybe in the next DLC. Yeah, okay, so this is Tower. Yeah, so Obviously it's- this is the front of a museum because they have those big big drapery things yeah and obviously tapestries. The, yeah and this looks way cooler than yeah it looks the actual awesome. tower got the, a, again flock of birds yeah my oh, favorite the tower does have flocks of birds you oh it does okay but uh he, this kind of reminds me of like a mass effect city it does look like that yeah but we yeah. don't really have that in destiny no not really i mean mass effect is also it's much more broad than i, I got bored of mass effect because of the options to be honest oh, I, I, mean, I found the dialogue like okay okay come on. i never got tired Let's of get it, to it. I, uh, I wish i didn't because i love sci-fi yeah i do i do i listened to every line of dialogue i just talked to anyone i could talk to in that game and just sat through it okay it was interesting to me yeah i, I love that i want and I love that it's optional. It doesn't force feed it to you. All right, well, doing... let's have a fight about Mass Effect some other day. Yes. Actually, we should do a video about it. Yeah. It <laughs> should be all dialogue choices, so we'll have to do it. This guy is kind of cool. He looks got, he's got some piping going into his body. Is that like a character? Or any any equipment um, you recognize? I wish no, I, I mean, there are some sort of hunter chest plates that have a little bit of a tube coming off and going nice. back into the chest plates. Nothing that extreme. Okay, all right. Another shot of the tower. The, okay, that's the tower. Is I would this, assume that's the tower big thing because here? you see the staircase to the bottom right. That's kind of the stair uh, pattern in the tower. This here, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay, this. Sort of, okay, gotcha. But aside from that, not much more resembles. It's, it's built you know, within the Destiny aesthetic, yeah. the architectural. And now, what about this thing? Does that look familiar? Well, you can see ships taking off and oh. landing when you're in the tower. So oh, that, I thought that was a mosquito. No. <laughs> oh. All right, I was gonna say. All right, so the people are walking around, but it's very populated and very busy. Yeah, and, and you know, I, I think I could be wrong about this, but I think that the matchmaking in the tower is limited to a maximum of sixteen people. Okay, well, it's, there's technical limitations. It's not... Yeah, and the the problem is is that most people in the tower are either standing around or dancing, yeah. emoting. So it just kind of takes the seriousness away from it. Sure, that's true. Or they're playing soccer. Yeah, like a bunch of Europeans. Exactly. All right, here's a, a shot from the upcoming season of Game of Thrones. Yeah. <laughs> So we've got the lion. Again with the tiger. Uh, the, yeah. Oh, yeah, the tiger. It looks like his ear things are different than the one up yeah. above. But um, is this just like a, a tent? It's kind of yeah, tough to I mean, see. Yeah, what this tells me... Armor, it looks like, yeah, or a helmet. They, w- these are skulls. Yeah, I would assume from seeing this, I was like, okay, I'm going to have companions, partners, pets, whichever one you want to call yeah. it, and I'm going to have a place of my own to store my gear. Maybe okay. my own little tent. This is yeah. where I put all my junk. This is I can invite people over. I can customize it. Nothing like I that. I see in the this game. and I think uh, whoever lives here probably smells. Yeah, it smells like my taint. God, I wish I was flexible enough to sniff my taint. I'd be down there all the time. Wow. Um, <laughs> I also it makes me think like okay, there's going to be a real big variety of types of people, foreign mm. guys. Yeah. You know, like Skyrim does a good job with that. Yeah, sort here of. you get the, three the notion that there's a far away and that there's yeah. close and there's far and like oh man, it's a long way to get there. Of course, you can fast travel. And blah, yeah, blah, blah. but I like the everybody likes a big stack of skulls. Who doesn't love a big stack of skulls? Okay, medieval looking sort of city uh not bad little game of thronesy you know is nothing like this in destiny though there's no giant landscapes no, no approaches and the to... sad thing is is that when when we played the beta for destiny uh-huh. and you got to go to the tower the main thing i was thinking of was like oh man i can't wait till we get to maybe chapter two and see what the town there looks like oh right or i wonder how many towns are on the moon that i can visit and what kind of vendors and npcs are there or how many are on venus there's only the tower is it 
Right. There's no there's Venus no, Tower. Yeah, there's no e- other... Even that's cheap to do. Yeah. Like, oh, it's the Moon Tower. It's yeah, the... and there's no other towns. There's no other... Yeah. You know... Even they did that on Genesis. They had other towns. Yeah, and the way they get around it is by saying things like, well, the Traveler of the Tower is the only place that the Guardians can go because it is the only remaining protection the yeah. Traveler cannot... Oh, Send me to a dangerous town. I don't care. Or put another town near the tower. Or yeah. the, the traveler. Or how about a town that's populated by, you know, fallen vendors or something like that who are maybe, right. you know, separated from yeah. the, the, the army who have defected. Who... Or Master Rahul's family. Yeah. You know? Or a ta- yeah, exactly. A, a big town bunch of... of blue weirdos. Yes, the town of the Awoken. You go to the outer rim where they are. Yeah. But you don't ever go back. You can't go back. <laughs> <laughs> and there's no town. You just you talk to the queen and her creepy brother for like five minutes, and that's it. Oh, man. It's I'm, so is frustrating. It like queen Amidala? Oh, well, yes, you is just. She, yeah. Hello, I'm Queen Amidala. Um, it's going to be okay. <laughs> All right, next one. I think we're getting near the end here. Yeah, it looks like a, is that a, like a tower castle in the this background. This looks like something my dad pooped. Give me a break. <laughs> no, it's actually nice. It's yeah, some sort of thing up on a hill. Yeah. That guy runs. He, these are where all the peasants live, and his, or mm-hmm. that's his army. And this is the asshole king because he owns. He, he's the first one to have the spice mine. Mm-hmm. You know where they when they carve cinnamon out of the out of the rock, <laughs> and uh, that's Dune. Looks like the set of Dune. Oh yeah, and our this is, favorite. Yeah, this is probably <laughs> the one that is the furthest away from what the game ended up being. Yeah. Um. Where do we start? So, uh, let's start at the <laughs> bottom right. So, you have what appears to be a warlock standing there. This guy here? No, to the right. One? Yeah. Okay. Just basically uh, gotcha. doing some weird hand thing. And then you got what appears to be a titan holding a broadsword. You're like, really? Is that... That's this one. Where's no, the bro- right here. there. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, you can get swords in the game in a very limited capacity, like the Sword of Crota or yeah. the swords from the, the Crota's Blades on Earth and the Moon and whatever. Nothing like that, though. Ever. Okay. I noticed something else about this picture that you don't seem to have picked up on. Mm-hmm. The giant fucking frog! James. Oh, uh, what did I just do? Do you see the frog? Leg, leg, eyeball, frog mouth. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not seeing it. <laughs> no. <laughs> so, what the fuck is this thing? Man, yeah. why? Okay, I would love a badass killer frog mm-hmm. that would make me happy in fact there are badass killer frogs they're called little frogs don't lick them mm-hmm. otherwise your grandma dies and then you have to go down to bolivia and fucking deal with the customs to get them to put her coffin on a plane and it's a real goddamn mess it took me fucking three weeks um so there's this are these goblins trolley people do these uh, ring like and they are they driving the frog are they are they like the it, guys in in lord of the rings that run the elephants it would appear so i mean there's only three races of enemies in the game you have okay. your vex which are the mechanical hive mind type guys yeah then you have the hive which are like the the you know the creepy thrall monster moon people and then you have the victoria's secret supermodels yes yeah well then in the fallen i'd love it if they were there <laughs> yeah but these represent None of those. Nothing you've seen. This is perhaps like a, a completely tossed away idea for yeah. an additional race of enemies. I want to see this frog. I think this frog deserves to, to, to be to live in a game somewhere mm-hmm. and not just on a concept art from Bungie on our YouTube channel. Yeah, I don't know. It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like she's like, holy shit, look at that fucking yeah. frog. I can't even see it. Oh, my God, I... Wish I brought my phone. I did Instagram this. And the frog doesn't even look like he cares that he's about to get swiped by a sword. But are they? No, I think they're. I don't think they're. Wait, are they? No, they're. They're. They're friends with the frog. The frog's down. Well, the ones on the. He's on strong. The... That frog could. You know why you can eat their legs is because they're full of muscle. No, oh. just like humans. Yeah. But they're down. This. These are buddies. Do you think these two are fighting? Yeah, I'm, get, I'm getting the uh, impression fighting... that the ones on the right are fighting the ones on the left. Although the guy holding the staff doesn't seem too concerned. Yeah, he. This guy seems pretty chill about. Yeah, what's he doesn't going seem on. to he care. Seem too yeah. alarmed. You can tell by body language when people are worked up. But here's another problem. How does a frog move? Uh, they hop, or right. they sort of slap their arms around. Right, and do you see like any sort of harness in the back with which those people can hold on to as the frog makes its I way? I don't. Th- I don't see one. So that makes me wonder if they're working with the frog or if they're hunting the frog. Yeah, that could be. I mean, maybe this guy's up top and he forgot to bring. He's just like about to punch. See that little fist right there? He's about yeah. to punch the frog. And go. Take that frog! Fuck you! And I, I guess it would Fuck make you. a lot more sense if one of them was like half hanging out of the frog's mouth that the frog is fighting back. <laughs> like a little leg just poking yeah. out of there. Yeah, it's a weird one. Yeah, you're right. Frogs hop. That'd mm-hmm. be tough to stay on. It's hard to stay on my own feet. I have a mm-hmm. hard time riding my shoes, let alone riding a frog. <laughs> the, 
But you know what? They're they're alien creatures who obviously live in this wooded D- Dagobah system mm-hmm. and dealing with these frogs. So if they're riding the frog, I'm just going to assume it's okay that they're they're, they're able to stay on pretty okay. well. People can ride horses bareback. Why not a frog bare frog back? You know, I'm with you. There's man. probably got like cool squirt glands. There's a, there's frogs that have like these glands on their sides, like this thing here. And when they when you squeeze it, it squirts out poison and can use it mm-hmm. to vanquish your enemies or your parents vanquish your parents they deserve it hey i didn't ask to exist neither did fuck you parents um all right that went weird so okay well we'll have to wait and see we don't know maybe maybe we'll create a movement so all right everybody james any other thoughts Hmm? want me to scroll back through okay concept art it's awesome bungie did a great job it's a really great game i want the game that's in these pictures you want we want to see the game that's in these pictures but at the same time it's a pretty fucking cool game yeah i like the the game but for uh for destiny 2 nail it nail it destiny bye everybody hit subscribe hit like watch your other videos also underwear goes on first i found that out. i knew i was doing something wrong yeah